For ages, humanity has looked up at the sky, filled with curiosity about the mysteries of the universe. In the 20th century, scientists introduced the theory now known as the Big Bang Theory. This theory struggled to provide clear answers to critical questions regarding the origins, development, and expansion of the cosmos. However, recent discoveries have made these puzzles even more intricate. In 2023, NASA's James Webb Telescope made an extraordinary discovery by identifying celestial bodies that seem to predate the universe itself. This revelation has left scientists in a state of confusion, contemplating the possibility that a star could exist for a period longer than the universe's existence. Does this challenge our current comprehension of the universe? Could this suggest the need for a new model to help us make sense of this anomaly? These pressing questions and many others will be explored in this video. If you're interested in staying updated on cosmic news and developments, consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to like this video and activate the notification bell. Approximately 200 light years away lies a remarkable star known as HD 140283, located in the constellation Asen Li. This ancient star's incredibly high velocity of 44,803 kilometers per hour offers important insights into its dramatic past. Around a billion years ago, our Milky Way galaxy merged with a dwarf galaxy, which was the star's original home. However, what makes HD 140283 even more astonishing is not its speed but its age. This star is one of the oldest celestial bodies observed to date, earning it the nickname Methuselah after the biblical figure said to have lived 969 years. Initial estimates suggested the star's age at a staggering 16 billion years, but more recent calculations have revised this to about 14.46 billion years with a margin of error of 800 million years. This figure presents a serious conundrum when compared to the age of the universe, which we calculate based on observations of the cosmic microwave background radiation, approximately 13.8 billion years. The question then arises, how could a star be older than the universe itself? At first glance, this seems impossible. This paradox has prompted further investigations into the star's age, the accuracy of our dating techniques, and the true age of the universe, opening the door to more profound explorations into these cosmic mysteries. To understand this better, it's important to recognize that determining the age of celestial objects is an extraordinarily complex task. Stars like our Sun remain stable in size and temperature for billions of years, making it challenging to estimate their age. Astronomers rely on subtle changes in the brightness and color of stars over time, comparing these changes with mathematical models that predict the star's evolution. A crucial factor in determining a star's age is its rotation rate. Over time, stars slow down, much like a spinning wheel losing speed due to friction. By comparing the rotation rates of stars of different ages, astronomers have established mathematical relationships that allow them to estimate their ages through a method called gyrochronology. Methuselah is indeed ancient, it's the oldest star in the universe whose age we can estimate with a reasonable degree of accuracy. Instead of wondering whether it might be more than 2 billion years older than its surroundings, we can approach the issue from another perspective. Could the universe be older than scientists initially thought? It's hard to grasp the sheer enormity of 13.8 billion years. To illustrate, imagine summarizing the entire history of the universe as a cosmic calendar. The Big Bang would represent the grandest New Year's fireworks display, and Earth would only make its appearance at the very end of the year. Human history, in this context, would account for just the last 10 seconds of December 31st. Scientists estimate the age of the universe by observing light from stars that formed hundreds of millions of years after the Big Bang. As the universe expands, a phenomenon called redshift occurs, where light stretches as it travels through space. By examining both the observable distances and the rate of expansion, astronomers conclude that the universe is about 13.8 billion years old. However, recent research from the University of Ottawa suggests that the universe might be much older, possibly around 26.7 billion years. Professor Rajendra Gupta, a physicist at the University of Ottawa, has proposed a theory combining ideas from Swiss astronomer Fritz Zwicky's 1929 theory with newer concepts. This theory suggests that protons lose energy as they travel across vast distances and times. 
While this contradicts some observable data related to redshift, Gupta argues that by allowing this theory to coexist with universal expansion, we could reinterpret redshift as a hybrid phenomenon which is not solely due to expansion. This rethinking could push the age of the universe further back and offer solutions to long-standing cosmological questions, as well as new ones raised by NASA's findings. The James Webb Space Telescope has played a key role in reaching the 26.7 billion year estimate. Gupta integrates the tired light theory with the concept of evolutionary interaction constant, a term first introduced by theoretical physicist Paul Dirac. This suggests that interactions within the universe might have evolved over time. It's worth noting that scientists have revised their estimates of the universe's age multiple times. For instance, in the 1920s, Edwin Hubble proposed that the universe was only 2 billion years old. Over time, these estimates have been refined, with the current estimate being double that figure, marking an important milestone in our understanding of the cosmos. Regardless of whether we compare the recorded history of humanity to just 10 seconds or 5 seconds in the universe's vast timeline, one thing is undeniable. The universe is incredibly ancient and awe-inspiring. Its continuous expansion challenges previous ideas about its age. But there are also intriguing findings regarding our own galaxy, the Milky Way. Recent studies suggest that stars in the outer regions of our galaxy are moving more slowly than those in similar positions in other galaxies. This raises several possibilities. One explanation is that our galaxy may have an unusually small amount of dark matter, the invisible substance that significantly influences the gravitational forces within cosmic objects. Another possibility is that our understanding of dark matter, specifically its quantity in the universe, might be flawed. This puzzle originates from data gathered by the European Space Agency's Gaia satellite, which provides detailed measurements of the positions of nearly 2 billion stars within the Milky Way. This data has led astronomers to rethink their assessments of stellar behavior, particularly in the outer regions of our galaxy. The speed at which stars move is a key indicator for calculating the mass of a galaxy, as gravitational force acting on each star depends on the galaxy's total mass. A recent study using data from the Gaia satellite determined that the Milky Way's combined mass, including gas, dust, stars, and dark matter, is about 200,000 billion times the mass of our sun. Although this is a considerable amount, it's still about five times smaller than previous estimates. This reduction is attributed to the unexpected decrease in the visible material in our galaxy. A possible explanation is that dark matter might be less abundant than scientists initially believed. However, calculating a galaxy's mass is a notoriously difficult task, and this new analysis raises the possibility that the data collected by the Gaia satellite or the methods used to interpret it might contain errors. We will remain vigilant for further updates and discoveries in the future. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll keep you informed with the latest developments. See you in the next one. As we continue exploring the cosmos, it becomes clear that the mysteries surrounding our universe are far from being fully understood. New discoveries are constantly reshaping our understanding of how the universe works and how it has evolved over time. Whether it's the discovery of stars that seem older than the universe itself or unexpected findings about the nature of dark matter, the questions that remain unanswered continue to fuel scientific curiosity. One area that requires more attention is the concept of dark matter. This invisible substance is thought to make up a significant portion of the universe's mass, yet it remains elusive and difficult to detect. While we have a good understanding of its gravitational effects on galaxies and clusters of galaxies, we still don't know what it is made of or how it behaves on smaller scales. The recent findings about the movement of stars in the outer regions of the Milky Way could suggest that the presence of dark matter may not be as large as previously thought, or that our understanding of its role in the structure of the universe needs to be revisited. In light of this, astronomers and physicists are looking for new ways to detect and understand dark matter. They are exploring a variety of possible candidates for dark matter, including weakly interacting massive particles, WIMPs and axions, and even considering the possibility that dark matter might not exist at all in the way we currently imagine. The search for dark matter is still ongoing, with scientists using a variety of techniques to probe the cosmos in new ways. This includes conducting experiments in laboratories deep underground to shield from cosmic rays 
or using the most advanced telescopes and observatories to look for faint signals from dark matter interactions in space. Meanwhile, the advancements in our observational tools have been truly remarkable. The James Webb Space Telescope has revolutionized the way we study the cosmos by allowing us to peer further back in time than ever before. Its ability to capture detailed images of distant galaxies, star-forming regions, and exoplanets has opened up new avenues for research. With the information it provides, scientists are gaining insights into the formation and evolution of galaxies, the birth of stars, and the potential for habitable worlds beyond our own. The discovery of celestial bodies that appear older than the universe itself, such as the star HD 140283, has left scientists puzzled, questioning the accuracy of their measurements and the models they use to estimate the age of the universe. This is just one example of how our current understanding of cosmology might need to be revised as new data comes in. The fact that a star could exist that seemingly predates the universe challenges not only our scientific theories but also our fundamental understanding of time and the laws of physics. As we continue to investigate the nature of the universe, we must remain open to the idea that some of our most basic assumptions might be wrong. This is the nature of scientific progress. Continually testing, questioning, and refining our theories in the face of new evidence. Whether we are revising our estimates for the age of the universe or seeking to unlock the secrets of dark matter, each new discovery brings us one step closer to a more complete picture of the cosmos. The ongoing study of cosmic expansion also plays a crucial role in refining our understanding of the universe's history. The observed redshift in light from distant galaxies provides evidence that the universe is expanding. This expanding universe model is central to the Big Bang Theory, but the redshift phenomenon is also key to the new ideas being proposed by scientists like Professor Rajendra Gupta. By reinterpreting redshift and combining it with other concepts such as the tired light theory, new theories about the universe's age are being proposed. These ideas are challenging the standard model and opening the door to new ways of thinking about the cosmos. In the realm of galaxy dynamics, the Milky Way is also proving to be an interesting subject of study. The newly discovered behavior of stars in the outer reaches of our galaxy suggests that there may be more to the story of how galaxies evolve and how their mass is distributed. The discovery that our galaxy might have less dark matter than previously assumed could significantly alter the way we view the formation and behavior of galaxies in the wider universe. Ultimately, the search for answers to these questions is not just about understanding the past or the present. It's about preparing for the future. As our tools and techniques continue to improve, we are likely to discover even more astonishing truths about the universe. Whether it's unveiling the true nature of dark matter, unlocking the secrets of cosmic expansion, or finding evidence of civilizations on distant exoplanets, the journey of exploration and discovery will never end. As we continue to push the boundaries of our knowledge, we must remain humble and acknowledge that we may not have all the answers. But each step forward brings us closer to understanding the incredible complexity of the universe and our place within it. The cosmos is vast, mysterious, and constantly evolving. And as long as we continue to ask questions, we will be on the path toward uncovering its many secrets. If you're passionate about space and the mysteries of the universe, make sure to stay updated on the latest discoveries. Science is always evolving, and new findings are published regularly challenging our understanding of everything from the nature of time and space to the origin of life itself. Stay tuned, keep exploring, and as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments section below.